this four spice basta fillets recipe makes a weeknight meal perfect. Done in under 30 minutes, it's crispy on the outside with an inner flesh that simply melts in your mouth. Now, it's one of the most loved recipes in our home and so simple to pull off. Make sure to dry the basa fish fillets thoroughly before you start cooking. Now people often worry about fish sticking to the pan and one way to prevent this is to make sure the basa fillets are as dry as can be. Now don't rush this step folks. Yes, I like to use my hands and you want to make sure that both sides are coated completely. Bear in mind, you will end up with turmeric coloured fingers. Now what's great is that you can use this spice blend with other types of fish and seafood. The tried and tested ones from my kitchen are salmon, cod, haddock and shrimp. In a large skillet or pan, heat oil over medium to high heat. Make sure the oil evenly coats the pan and is nice and hot before you add the fish. Place the spice coated basa fillets in the pan and cook for about five to six minutes per side or until cooked through. The length of the time will depend on the thickness of your fillets and also the efficiency of your pan. Now avoid fiddling with the basa fillets. I know it's tempting because otherwise you risk breaking the fish apart. Let it sit and once it's ready, nice and golden, it should release from the pan pretty easily. Serve with a squeeze of fresh lemon juice if you prefer. You can marry this basa fillet fish with a delicious colourful salad and sweet potato and voila! You have an enticing and satisfying meal. The kids love fish wraps with my creamy avocado chutney slathered on a flax and hemp burrata. It's always a knockout. like this video give it a thumbs up or leave me a comment I'd love to know what diet and nutrition related topics or recipes you'd like me to dive into next thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe and if you want to be a super subscriber turn on that notification bell so you never miss another video